Hello everybody, Tommy Ruin here and welcome back to the next episode in my Let's Play series. You may be wondering why I'm swimming in the middle of the Ghostlands. That is because I did record an episode before this, but I didn't actually record the video. So I've got the camera and my audio, but none of the actual recording of the game. So I'm going to play some clips of what happened in the audio so you can kind of get a general feel about what happened. But I, I'll, I'll explain as the episode goes on what, what, what went on and what you need to know kind of thing. So enjoy these clips and I will see you in a minute. Get dead. Get dead. Yeah, get dead. Maybe that's what I need. I need a shitty pet so I can be shittier. So this isn't just a walk in the park. So this challenge isn't just a cake in the box. That age old for phrase. Cake in the box. It's my cake in a box. What will make my pet the crappiest? If I go with that then I won't die. But the whole point is that I'm meant to make this exciting and almost die quite a few times. I think. Is that why you guys are here? Watching me suffer? I think I'll just stick with this guy now, as he is, because he doesn't have anything to do. He just goes rah. And then he's done. But I haven't actually made any gear yet. Because it all sucks dick. I can make some nice panties. Hello, sailor. Oh, Knuckle Rotten Lurzan. Hello. That'll be a fun quest to try and do. Right, this big guy. He's gonna is an elite, isn't he? An or an not suten. Pretty sure he was elite. Oh bollocks! Shit! He's nearly dead. We killed him. Nice work, Lion. But there's still a lot of them. Fuck! 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 Come on, Lion. Bollocks. Do I have any patience? Bollocks, bollocks, bollocks. Can I s oh shit, I'm dead. Fuck, fuck, okay. Oh my lord. I did not realise that he was going to do that. Thank you, Lion. See, I feel like I'm kind of cheating there because if I didn't have the pet I would be dead. But I'm so glad I'm not. Right, so we did a lot of quests last episode. We didn't quite get to level 4 15, but we're nearly there. Uh, we got a weapon upgrade. We got a new pet, Lion. But yeah, we are now going to get some plans uh, from these guys on this island. This cool little druidy man. Druidy man. I don't actually know where the plans are. Are they all on this island? Oh, they are. How convenient. So yeah, I felt like an absolute fool after recording the whole of last episode. It was about an hour's worth of me just talking, no actual game footage. And I thought it was some of the some funny stuff, if I do say so myself. So I was quite annoyed. It also meant that I just wasted an hour of my life, which I could have been doing, like making uh, making an actual video. But hopefully, you guys forgive me. You all seem like nice people. Please forgive me. <laughs> what am I looking for here? Oh, there they are. So there should be some more plans. Oh, there's that. Ooh. Sneaky, sneaky. These guys are a bit better than those humans who just left them lying around on the floor. A lot of gears dropping with versatility and I don't understand. Have they removed spirit? If so, pretty damn cool. You have some very versatile casters. Oh, Jesus. I'm actually taking quite a bit of damage here. Because I've got no armor. Absolutely none. Go, Lion. Oh, shit. There's three of them. That's one. I might ding. That would help. I always love it when you're mid combat and you ding and you go right back up to full. And you're like, ha ha. Round two. 
Right, now we need to go to Windrunner Village. And then, oh no, maybe not there. And then we need to go do, get some troll juju. Yeah, man. Get the troll juju. It's really pissing me off that I can't wear the gear which I loot. Because some of it's actually been pretty good. I did get a two-handed um, two mace uh, dropped when I wasn't actually recording. And I couldn't use it because it's a mace. But I'm getting some pretty good drops. And I'm piss it's pissing me off that I can't use it. Even this grey is an upgrade. Something I'd like to do at the beginning of these episodes is give a shout out to those who say something nice in the comments. So this episode I'd like to give a shout out to Mean Boy Sanic who said he's already excited for the next episode. I hope you watched it and I hope it was as good as you were hoping for. Um, and then also to Nixium, the man who inspired me to do this challenge actually commented on my video and I thought that was amazing. So thank you Nixium. If you watch another one, hi. <laughs> um, and yeah, we will see who can survive the longest. I'm so glad that this episode's actually recorded. Yeah, oh, say that, I looked up and I didn't actually see the uh, the light first time. But yeah, I'm so glad that this is actually recording now because it really annoyed me. I finished and I was like, oh, now I don't have anything to put out to you guys. So this week, I'm really sorry, but I've been so crap at making my videos. I've been working most days and yeah, it's just been really, really... I, I rendered a video for two and a half hours yesterday, uh, a PvP video, and the final footage was just like really blotchy. Oh, hello, level 15. Um, yeah, I didn't get any. What? I need to go to an inn, for fuck's sake. What? Nice. Oh, sweet, I've got a ranged attack. Um, yeah, so the footage just had some like black, black bits on it. That's so cool. Uh, so I couldn't use it, so I had to re-render it overnight. So yeah, I've had a very, very frustrating few days in terms of YouTube recording. But hey, we're getting there, and it's the weekend. Oh shit. Shit, 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 shit. Quickly, die, die, die. Run, run, run. Where are you going? I'm not ready. I am not ready for you. We'll go over here. Fuck that. That's the first time I've seen them. Oh. Yeah. I don't want to run into those. Like. They just appear around the corner. And me be really like trapped or something. Because. I'll just die straight away. And then it's game over. I probably will start again. But. It would be GG. But. At, at the end of this. I am going to try and kill them. It's going to be like a uh, rocky moment. Okie dokie. Now we head to. Sanctum of the Sun. I might go to pick up the questies there I know that this zone ends with a big quest and you get like a big two-handed sword but I think it's blue and I don't think I'm allowed to wear blues um, but I'm still yet to get a melee weapon from a quest reward which is starting to piss me off maybe I should have taken blacksmithing just for that fact when do I next get an ability eagle eye yes that one's so important so hopefully in this episode, I will not have a green screen behind me. Shit, is that the next one? Oh boy. Luz oh, it's Luzran, not Lurzan. Whoops, my bad. See, I used to think it was Knucklerot and Lurzan, but it's Knucklerot and Luzran. There we are, the more you know. I cannot wait to have to take on these guys. It's going to take me like a few years to actually find them, because I spent about two hours here yes uh, when I was recording last, and... I didn't see them once, and now I've seen them in the space of about five minutes of each other, which is weird. Wonder if they're friends. Probably are friends. If I remember my lore correctly, when I was making my uh, most important blood elves, Dark Andrathir, which is the guy which is in charge of all the uh, undead around here, was once a blood elf, and he joined the dark side of the Lich King and basically let everyone in, let all the um. All the undead past the uh, blood elf or high elf centuries and yeah killed basically he basically um, sold his sold his people out to uh, Arthas so he's a nice guy and he's actually like a level 18 elite final quest guy pretty pretty big deal that quest but we'll try and do it so yeah law 101 I should probably go back to tranquil and soon as well because those troll quests are not going to do themselves 
Maladash, Malanore. Maladash, Malabash, We're gonna Hearthstone now. I actually set my Hearthstone in Triquillum compared to the first episode where I think I must have told myself to do it four times and then I didn't actually go and do it, which was very stupid of me. I don't really understand how I've got base 15% crit. Oh, so I'm here at the trolley, trolley land. Time to get your jujus on. I remember these guys being very generous with their uh, drops in terms of how many greens and stuff they give. Which is frustrating because I can't use them. I feel quite bad killing trolls. My bros, my forest bros. Pretty shitty model, I'm not gonna lie. It's still recharging. Oh. 10 seconds, Jesus. We haven't got that kind of time. I'm so good with the throwing axe for, for a wall. So. As the uh, pre-patch is downloading at the moment, as we speak right now, I was wondering if you guys think I should continue this challenge on live, i.e. remake this character on my account and get him up to the same place as we are now and then continue the challenge on live because the beta is going to be going away. If you guys are enjoying this and you want me to continue it, then I can just remake Polacco on a realm in the real servers and continue it when the pre-patch hits because all of the changes which will affect us so far are going to be there and then I can continue this challenge for the rest of time. So many chests here which I can't open. How annoying. Oh dear. That's an escort quest. That could be exciting times. There we go. Right, so now I just need to farm jujus. I love that word. Juju. Your juju be buju. Right, they're not pulling each other. I might be able to take on three here. Let's do it. Yeah, they're not pulling each other. They don't care. Look, I'm right next to him. Oh, there we go. Right, it's time to break out the uh, berserk, I think. Holy moly. I think we got this, boys. That's three. Shit. I love that. <laughs> oh, dear. That's pretty... Uh, I, think, I think that's the scariest... Well, actually, it did get pretty scary last episode because the... Oh, shit. There's a lot of them in here. Anub, Anubarak guy. I don't know his actual name. I can't remember it. Um, the one from... That village with all the spiders. You know the place. Uh, yeah, that was pretty scary. I was killing them as you do. Yada yada, normal stuff. And then it was just about to die. I want them so bad, but I can't use them. Um, yeah, I was about to kill the main dude, the big elite guy. It wasn't too bad. It was only a two-person um, two quest. Can you walk any faster? It was only a two-person quest, and I killed him, and then suddenly, everybody help, everybody help, I'm dying. And he summoned over loads of um, little fellas, and I got swarmed, and Lion took one for the team and killed himself. But yeah, it was a pretty, pretty frightening times. I hope they sorted out escort quests in Legion. Come on. I feel like kind of like a, a sniper just throwing axes at people like so accurate are you all right are you finished or are oh, you run now nice holy moly that's a lot of quests 